Going down, Molly Skyler fans. Welcome back to Skyler Nation. Mom and woman versus food. Eating like a girl. Always cleaning my plate because wasted food is rude. Back at ya. Ooh. Got another good one for you. Actually, I just honestly got off of a live stream with my friend Katie Prettyman that Beyond Seattle Eats. Um, we both actually did the uh, Wheelie Peas chocolate. Chocolate raspberry rain. Um, chocolate bar challenge. It was 15 minute. Not bad at all. It was it had a little bit of spice. Got a little bit right here. Got a little bit of tip of my tongue. That was about it. So really not bad. Actually pretty darn enjoyable. Pretty tasty with that jam inside. So neither of us really complained. We thought it was a good challenge, but for the five points that we got off of it, I really don't see it was if it was uh, quite worth that. It didn't really have the punch I expected. But either which way, it was fun. Thank you, Katie, once again for that. That was awesome. But because of the fact that I'm really not suffering and I'm still sitting here since I just got off of that live feed, I'm going to go for this one. I do have the Willy Pete's chocolate bar, half pound. Johnny Scoville's chili cherry nightmare. Ooh, hot level. Look at it. Ugh, danger level on the heat. This is also another 15 minute challenge with this i have to i can't start the five minute afterburn until after the full 10 minutes so it kind of sucks no matter what i gotta go 15 minutes uh, i have 10 minutes to in to consume the bar i actually have not checked on the record i guess it wasn't important because as long as i finish it that's how i feel it i should go with uh, it's not important to me if i have the record on that or not so it is what it is Anyway, so I do have this bar right here. Like I said, I've got no drinks, no whatever. I gotta sit through those 15 minutes and then it is what it is. Loving it. Thank you, League of Fire and Old Agnes Store for getting me turned on to this world. It's been pretty amazing. I'm not gonna say that my toilet's not gonna pay for it in the end, but you know it probably will. All right, so here we go. I do have the Willie Peeps chocolate bar here. And honestly, let me get over this little do dad because you guys expect me to read this anyway because that's what we do see how animated i can get sit here certain dancing dancing queen i'm ollie skyler i'm over 18 years of age of sound mind and have read and understood the hot sauce product disclaimer on the league of fire website and so we accept the league of fire and their suppliers and manufacturers will under no circumstances be responsible for or liable for it any claims of injury or damage arising from me consuming this product or multiples thereof i acknowledge and greed this fact without question yes let's do this all right so I've got my chili, cherry nightmare chocolate bar. Cannot be altered, no drinks. It is a half pound bar and it looks like a big old brick. So, mm, definitely has a smell to it. It's got eight chocolate squares on there. Yeah, whatever. I'm not gonna blend it up or do anything to this darn thing so i've got 10 minutes to eat this thing let's do this because we're just gonna do it molly skyler skyler nation versus chili cherry nightmare bar from J from johnny scoville burner butts three two one go Hmm. A little spicy.
216. All right. So now I've got like 13, 12 minutes and 30 seconds ish to go. Um, I will say this one definitely had a little bit more spice than this one. Ugh. That has quite a bit more heat. So this is the dark chocolate infused with Carolina Reapers and black cherries. Ah. It does definitely have a punch on the tip of my tongue. Not gonna lie. It is tasty, but man, that's got it. It's, it's creeping towards the front of my mouth right now. Yeah. Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. Definitely. It's good though. It was tasty. Um, actually, I don't leave any less on the little crumbs here on the counter because gosh, for a bit of cat comes in here and tries to eat this stuff. Okay. Little tiny itty bitty crumbs. Um, definitely delicious. Um, like I said, I'm still new to the doing all these little spice challenges here and there. Um, trying to get some couple under my belt and see how I do with these. I do tend to handle the spice a little bit better than some people. I'm not saying I'm the best, but I know I'm not the best actually. I'm far from the best. I end up getting the hiccups, especially every time I do these. I don't know why. Oh gosh. Um, yeah, a couple of people have inspired me to do this. Katie Prettyman, uh, a couple of the other spice heads. Um, I just, they're fun. I like to see what I can do, push my limits. See how much of the hiccups I can get. Um, like I said, some of these really, some people just can't do that. I've got two of these, whatever I've done. Oh my God. <laughs> so the heat definitely is not getting me right now. I do need to do still, and I'm not going to be doing these today. Oh my gosh. Um, I do have the chili peats white chocolate cherry. And I do have the Moab gold. I will be doing that. And then I also have, in addition to that... Two more. I've got the Crazy Kimberlin's Bar, milk chocolate, with ba bacon, and then I do have the Nemesis. This one right here is gonna probably be the one that I end up having to uh, face the fire. Five minutes down, 10 minutes to go. So, I guess, like I said, the burn, I'm not really getting much of a burn. Like I said, I've got, I don't know. Um, a little bit of burn in the front of my mouth. I'm not really going to say it's really an overkill. Um, very enjoyable bar. It has a good flavor to it, but it definitely had some spice to it. A little bit, not quite as spicy as, like I said, the other ones, but the only one of my chocolate bars I'm really honestly technically afraid of is the Nemesis right here. This one, I will be doing a live with, um, Katie Prettyman um, at Beyond Sale Eats for that bar. So I do have four more chocolate bars I will be doing some of these with. Um, a lot of these, like I said, I'm doing through the League of Fire. Um, I do... Oh my god. These are point weighted challenges. So the faster that you do them, the more you do. Like I said, it is going to be... Uh, Let's see, where it's kind of like a points-based system. You can go to their website. You can actually see a lot of the people who do the spice challenge challenges and um, kind of see how they've done and how many points they are. I am nowhere near the top, and I never expect to be there either, just because of the fact that I haven't done this long enough, and I have no desire to be on the top of that one. I, you know, it's not, it's not going to happen. That's their world. I will dabble in it here and there. Uh, I can handle it, but it's just like, eh. I don't really, no, oh, I don't know, maybe someday, <laughs> but uh, yeah, League of Fire, like I said, great organization to work with. Uh, I did get all my chocolate, bar, chocolate bars once again through Old Agnes store out of Oregon. Um, phenomenal customer service, great people, and uh, if you're looking for any good spice challenges, I obviously they can provide um, you with a easy way to order, go online, grab that. Um, yeah. Other than that, um, oh God, I just keep hiccuping. I hate this. 
<laughs> I've got the burn really isn't getting me. Like I said, it's got a little bit up here, a little bit at the top of my mouth. I'm not. The chocolate bars really haven't ever won me over. I love the flavor, but the spice doesn't get me. So I'm um, not saying they're not spicy. Yes, they are. But because of the fact I'm able to eat them faster, unfortunately, that might, might be part of the fact that that's why it's not going to ever hit me. Because you can these are still kind of timed. Um, the ones where you do have to slow down and do it every X amount of minutes, that's where I'm going to run into the problem because... You keep putting it back in your mouth, back in your mouth, back in your mouth. Um, like I said, I'm more of a speed and or capacity eater. But like I said, it is what it is. So anyway, with that, like I said, anyone who wants to do sponsorships for, for any other videos, if you'd like to, um, especially uh, bigger capacity and or fa fast food, you are more than welcome to sponsor something there. Look down in the description below. There are ways to contact me and just run a bike me first before you want to do anything. Um, always welcome to, you know, put a couple suggestions in if you want to. And if you also have a cure for hiccups, I would love that. And uh, let me know because that is just not my, uh, not my forte, I guess. It's kind of annoying and makes me sound stupid. Not gonna lie. <laughs> All right, I'm at nine minutes. I got about six left. So my afterburn time is about to start. <sighs> yeah. Um, I don't know. It is what it is. Like I said, I've got a lot of things going on here in my life. And if you, you know, anyone ever wants to come around to Maryland, you want to come out and eat with me, you're more than welcome to at this point. I, uh, I don't know. Kind of looking for new areas to go off into with new challenges. If there's a big cluster somewhere, I'd love to travel this summer. Um, I don't know. Also, should I cut my hair off? I'm thinking about I'm thinking about wiping the mohawk out and starting all over. I could wear a wig. <laughs> not opposed to that. I'm not afraid of wearing a wig, guys. So if you'd like, anyone knows how to put one of these things on. I'm thinking about wiping my, the Mohawk out, so have a whole new style for uh, 2021. Well, unfortunately, I have to cut all the hair off to do that. So, all right, guys, my after burn time has started, even though it technically started eight minutes ago. <laughs> oh my god! I guess I'm not feeling anything, guys. Like I said, now it's I've got a little bit of a burn in the back of my throat on top of my mouth. And that's really about it. Um, you know, like I said, it was a good challenge, but the, the challenge, the, ch the chocolate ones have not been hitting me as much. Like I said, I did do that one earlier with Katie, and that it, it was delicious, absolutely delicious. And, you know, for the most part, good stuff. Um, really did not push me in either direction. Um, like I said, it was more of a flavor. It, it's really hard to swallow chocolate whole when it's cold. So I actually, I mean, I did chew it apart actually pretty well. I mean, it was faster chewing, but I mean, I did chew it apart. So it's not like I just swallowed the chocolate hole. I can't swallow that chocolate hole. It's, it would choke me to death. I would never be able to melt it in my throat. So a um, little bit more difficult for me to do stuff like that. I don't mind having to chew my food. I just am not used to it. So, but you know with that, that's how, that's how the game's played, you know? So got about three and a half more minutes. And then we'll be on our way. Like I said, I'm not going to hold off on this one longer because I really don't have a whole heck of a lot to say today. It is a Sunday night and it is about 10.30 p.m. And, uh, yep, it is the day before Memorial Day. Remember what this holiday is about. We're honoring the ones who are fallen and that gave all so that you can have all. So... Whatever your stance is on that, just remember what the day is for. So, honor some people out there, guys. You know, a lot of people gave a lot, gave their lives for, you know, everything that kind of happened. And uh, where we are is where we are. So, respect, man. All about respect. So, 
hope you have a great holiday weekend i know this is obviously going to be posted after the holiday but you know still hope it was good hope y'all were responsible and did all your thing and ate lots of food and did some good things so other than that let's see where we're at oh i've got two and a half minutes oh, i'm just tired at this point oh my gosh um I will be having a video coming up. I got a, a sponsorship to do some Burger King. Um, I do, by the way, have... Um, I'd like to do the Cap Gun Challenge again. And if anyone would like to sponsor that one, I think that one is like $30. And I screwed it up the first time, but I'm going to be doing that with Katie Prettyman. So if anyone wants to sponsor a couple boxes of that, supposedly it's supposed to be awful. And I did it, and it was not awful. But I kind of screwed up the first half of it even though it didn't really reflect the second half of it, and it is what it is, but I need to rebuy that, so stuff like that. These end up being pretty pricey, stuff like this, so anybody who wants to go all out and uh, make my day a little bit easier, please do, because it costs a lot to feed my cats. Cat treats are really, mm, along the side, along the side yeah, kind of like along the side of the price of lumber, it's like, Cow treats, wood, you know, it's, it's breaking the bank, dude. But like I said, I appreciate everyone who is watching. I appreciate everyone who likes and subscribes. Please do, please do. Always, like I said, this is kind of an overrun one, but of course I have to go for the whole 15 minutes for this to count. So therefore, it's gonna be 15 minutes. Um, like I said, I won't have anything after say, I have to say after whatever, I'm just gonna cut out here, so. But like I said, I do appreciate everyone who watches. You know, like I said, it's... I've been doing this for approximately... Oh gosh, almost eight years now. No, nine years. I started in August of 2012. So, nine years now I'm doing all this stuff. And like I said, I've met some pretty cool people and I got some great fans out of it, so... Like I said, thank you very much. I appreciate everything. Um, like I said, if anyone would like to sponsor once again, look down into the description of the video find out where you can contact me or my editor and we will get you on your way if you want to see something cool or if you have any great ideas like i said i can't get to everything but like i said i will i do try so once again if you want to do it just let me know but thanks again guys i'm signing off here molly skyder mom and woman versus food Not impressed. Delicious though. <laughs> See you guys later. Thanks for watching. Have a great night.